Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, we are in Sacramento, California, about to check out Sinister Creature Con. Only difference is this time around, we are here as vendors. Uh, my girlfriend, Reyna, has her uh, small business, Pretty Creepy, if you guys wanna check her out. Uh, you can find her on Facebook. And uh, yeah, she sells some cool jewelry, necklaces, bows, stuff like that. And I uh, will be giving you guys a small tour of uh, not only her booth, but you know, everybody else's booth, kind of give you guys what, a taste of what Sinister Creature Con is all about. I've been here once before. This is, however, a, a different venue, a little bit, you know, slightly smaller venue, but let's check it out. So about to show you guys uh, what the show is all about. Let's do it.
Section to give you weird boners. <laughs>
thank you so much for coming out here because I've been waiting a long time for you to like come somewhere up here. So. I wanted to come for so long, but yeah. I was always shooting, and then as soon as the strike started, I was like, yeah. have it open for me. Yeah. I want to go. <laughs> Yeah. Can I ask for a specific quote? Okay yes, but do you care where it's signed? I um, usually sign it here because Brian, Kevin, or Jeff sign up there. Yeah, yeah. Right here, so yeah. can you pull it a little bit? Can you, there, oh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> so let me do this first. New again. Okay. And then what is the quote? It's, a, it's yes, I unlock your one rude motherfucker, but you're cute as hell. All right, so uh, yes, is it yes, Silent Bob, or yes? Yes, Silent Bob. Yeah. yeah. Silent Bob. Yes, Silent Bob. You're a rude motherfucker. Thank you so much. So, uh, if, uh, if we could have you write for a quote, uh, just 37 with a question mark. That's it? <laughs> hey, you're Simple. Easy. Simple. <laughs> Can you write the character name as well? Sorry about that. that. I missed that. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's all right, I just got slide over a little bit. Thank you so much. I can't watch Clerks 3 again. I love when they come oh, with I'm ideas. So sorry. Because I'm, I'm Tom Thomas. Your performance was... Oh my god. Thank you. I, I cried. I cried. We were talking about it after. I'm like, I just started crying then. I started crying yesterday. I was like, I can't watch it again. Yeah, she hates when I start even talking about I'm it. Like, I'm like, I'm like, what? You get your head? I'm like, yeah. <laughs> and my best friend still hasn't seen it either. And I'm like, eh. Thank you. I don't know. Thank you. It means a lot. That's all right. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> There you go, Captain. Oh, actually, uh, sorry, can we do the character name as well? Sure. You guys go to the go, Captain. There we go. Very good. You might be right. Hi, how are you? Good. Wow. I love this one. I have never seen this. Yeah, I just got it. So, wow. where would you guess? Oh, yeah. oh my gosh, I forgot his name. It's Black One, right? Yeah. I, it might be. I'm not sure if it is. But yeah. it was the last one he had. It's a bunch of people just right here. I had his car, but I forgot his name. PJ. Yeah. PJ is great too. That's cute. Yeah. And I guess I should put my my name right here. Yeah, sure. Do you want me to go black or red or what? Let's do black. Do you want me to keep it? Do you want me to keep it like this, or can I go like that? Can we do it this way? Yeah. Yes. Like a long edge, edge himself. Yeah, I remember high school days. I was looking for this movie online forever. And I was like, I have to see this movie. I love their movies, and I love their character. Hey, look how they made these guys. Jesus. I don't think Johnny ever smiled. Yeah, <laughs> I don't think so. I really don't think Johnny looks as accurate in that photo. No. But, um, but yeah, I'm going to get PJ to sign this soon, too. I'm going to see her in the fall. So. Yeah. And I met Marky was here a couple years ago, too, so I wish I had this then. But, He's around. Yeah. He's out and around. Yeah. Awesome. Let me see you. And Sweet. quick question. Sure. Ice Cream Man, too. Is it... Well, it's happening. Not, it's not Ice Cream Man 2. Okay. It's, we're making another Ice Cream Man. Okay. And it's a different movie with different characters. I'm playing an Ice Cream Man, but that's it. I'm playing. It's a different guy. Okay. It's 
got a different story, different history. It's not, there's a few little Easter eggs hidden in the movie. Okay. That, that, that are a reference to the original, but that's it. It's nice. Written, you know. And is that is that shooting soon or? No, well, we've got the script. We okay. just had a cast reading of the script. It goes good. Cat, my wife Cat and I and Norman Epstein are producing. Cool. Awesome. Beautiful. Yeah. Thank you so much. Can, can we get the picture? Oh, of course. This would be really cool. <laughs> yeah. The shinning. The shinning. <laughs> you want to get seen? <laughs> These are Back at the hotel, Sinister Creature Con is all done. Mm -hmm. It was a two-day event. Great freaking turnout. Yep. My baby did great business-wise. Yeah, it went good. And then, um, yeah, we finally got a chance to check out all the vendors. So I'm going to show you guys now what we picked up. Yep. All right, so first up is this awesome freaking Simpsons poster my babe found. Yep, super dope. It's by, sorry, the business cards on the back. Um, Somewhere. Sorry. Uh, oh, I thought it was. Could have sworn I did. Probably moved it. Mm, yeah, I did. Sorry, guys. But um, super cool thing though is that it has an like appendix of like all the episodes, for, mm -hmm. which each one is from. For each uh, character, which yeah. is freaking awesome. Yeah, yeah, really, really cool. I love it. And my babe stopped by. Yeah, I stopped by the, uh, the Forever Midnight uh, podcast table. I listen to these guys daily. And they're good friends of mine, so I had them sign this poster because I'm a fucking nerd. Um, <laughs> as you can see, Brian signed Juju Secrets, and I didn't see that until after he um, signed <laughs> it. So I thought that was cool. Thanks, guys, if you're watching this. And uh, oh. oh, and then we got an autograph from Adam Green. Um, super nice dude. Got to actually talk to him um, and just get some cool info from him and just encouragement from him so that was really really cool yeah and some more stuff right here from uh forever midnight yeah these are from forever midnight um this is a necronomicon and this is really cool <laughs> um they came up with this a couple years ago so right here it says when more than just the dead start rising protect your boomstick mm -hmm. and then here's the inside cool and then here's that <laughs> so this is pretty cool and then we found this. This is freaking awesome. So this is like actual piece of brick from the Halloween 3 season of the witch uh, the, the, building. Uh, factory, the uh, Brian actually, I guess, had visited there. And naturally, obviously, the building is deteriorating. So he found like some little pieces and decided to put them in, you know, these little caps right here and preserve them. Mm -hmm. So I did get one from them, which is great. They also just came out with this sticker. This is a DJ Secret sticker. Um, if you know, you know. Um, it's a segment in their show, which is super <laughs> fun, where people share their poop stories. And then Stephen Kink, um, <laughs> another cool thing they did. They actually had the, um, a skateboard deck that they were selling. I'm not sure if it's sold, but super dope. And then this is my one of my favorites. This is Show Me Your Critties. Uh, <laughs> they actually released this a while back. Um, and they made a skateboard deck out of this, and they're supposed to do a pre-order for it. So nice. super duper cool. And then we found some stuff from various different uh, vendors. I found this freaking amazing uh, cabin key little mm -hmm. you know thingy. Yeah, super cool. And then we got my babe got these earrings. Got these movies earrings. I thought they were really really cool. And then Christian got this little demon's mask because he's getting into figure making, so you wanted to get it. We actually mm -hmm. got two of these. Yep. And then these are from my friend Leslie. She's Pink Pandemonium on Etsy. This is a, these are a bunch of really cool stickers. This is Omer from um, Brain Damage. Got the Crypt Keeper. I absolutely love this design. She made it into a pillow. Nice. Uh, and then this Art the Clown one, Accessorize. She just released this one. And then I got the Bad Bitch case, <laughs> the Belial nice. from um, 
basket case. These also are matches. They're from Forever Midnight as well. They're the same, but they're like big matches. And I was like, why the fuck not? They're really cool. And you and also then, visited uh, World's Best Comics. Yep. And I picked this up, the Street House of Horror. This is the Inside Out Bart from Nightmare Cafeteria. Um, I didn't even know about these. Um, there's a couple more. But it was between this one and this one, and I figured this one was cool because Christian really likes this segment. Yep. And then she also picked up this awesome horror magazine. I picked up the newest. Well, it's April, so um, this is April, March, April's horror hound. And then I also picked up this older um, issue, which is kind of cool. Um, it has like a convention schedule and everything in there, and like the Rip Twenty Twenty One, which is nice. And then we went to the cave. Yep. In Sacramento, we picked up some VHS. Yep. I picked up Love at First Bite. The Night of the Hunter, which is on Bravo's 100 Scariest Movie Moments of All Time, which mm -hmm. is the reason why I wanted to get it. Um, pretty, pretty creepy. And The Omen 2, which is like one of my introductions to horror, so I had to pick this up. And it's in a clam. Well, it's not a clam shell, but it's in like a hard box, so it'll be protected. Yeah, and so we that. also found... We found this guy right here. So yes. we found a The Fly McFarlane loose movie, movie maniacs, maniacs. Yeah. um for 17.99 which is a steal because you know finding them in the box is more expensive but this thing i didn't realize how detailed he was oh, yeah. Yeah, um he actually has like the furry feelers right here mm -hmm. and i didn't even notice it but he has little hairs on his back yeah <laughs> and so honestly i eventually want like a bigger version of this right um, something like possibly for Monster Palooza, but for now this will do. There's a little hairs right there too. <laughs> um, but yeah, super cool. He he found this, and I'm so thankful because I I probably wouldn't have even found something like this. Yeah, I was so. like lurking through yeah, all the the boogers right there. <laughs> right. So yeah, it's it's really really cool. So and this we, is one uh, of our good times. And we also picked up uh, some cool posters, which we're gonna show you guys right now. But wait, before that, we also have another little friend that we picked up from a friend of mine. Ooh. Can't so picked up this little guy. I named him Dante. Um, this is a Windy Willow Toad Purse by one of my friends. Decided to finally get one. Um, and, you know, own little uh, stamp there. This is Windy Willow Etsy yeah, check Instagram. Her out. Definitely check it out. Uh, these toads are very, very popular. I've seen them. She's been selling them like crazy. I finally decided to take the dive. And then these little pieces right here are accessories. So these ears come off. So you could have a naked toad if you wanted. But you can add accessories and things like that. She sells them too. So definitely check out Windy Willow. She has um, had a pre-order for the Skeletoads. But I think those sold out. But she should have some more on her website. So check them out. Nice. And next up, my babe picked up this rock and roll high school poster at uh, Monster Palooza. And of course, she wanted to have Clint sign it. Yep, I'm gonna have PJ sign it too at Halloween 45 Years of Terror. But uh, apparently, well, you'll see in the video um, his reaction to this poster. Um, yeah. <laughs> so super stoked that he signed it, and it's perfect that I signed it. So I'm excited. Oh, uh, yeah. So, uh, anyway, guys, here you go. And that's not all. We got one more poster for you guys. And last but definitely not least, the main reason uh, why we were attending, other than, you know, being vendors, obviously, at the show, we are both huge fans of Clerks. Uh, I mean, not only Clerks, but, you know, pretty much anything Kevin Smith. Mm -hmm. uh, we both freaking love. But this was the original. This is the one that started it all. And, uh, you know, everybody was there. Dante, freaking Randall, and Jay. They were all there signing autographs. Uh, you guys already saw in the video. Super nice. Yeah. Freaking. Jeff is super nice. And it's kind of cool to see him doing conventions now. Because before this, I'd never... I mean, he might have been at, like, some of Kevin's events. But, like, not conventions. And he is just the kindest guy ever. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, we had uh, all of them write quotes. We had uh, Jay sign... Silent Bob, you're a rude motherfucker, but you're cute as hell. And then we had Jeff Anderson, just simply, we kept it simple, 37, and question mark. he wrote Salsa Shark right here, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was all him, too. Yeah. We didn't ask him, but <laughs> that's great. I'll take two quotes. <laughs> and then, of course, we had Dante write, I'm not even supposed to be here today, his most iconic line. Which you guys already saw, I got super emotional talking to him, so... 
He yeah. was he was one of my favorite parts. Yeah, dude, Brian O'Halloran. I mean, both of them, Brian O'Halloran and Gorgeous. Jeff Anderson, Clerks yeah. Three, dude, they fucking knocked it out of the park. So, yeah, it was freaking great to finally meet him, and uh, hopefully we can get Kevin on this. Yeah, I hope so. Uh, you know, in the future. So there you guys go. And there you guys go. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, cool little video we did for Found some pretty dope Con. stuff, so I'm pretty happy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, it was my first time being a vendor, helping her out. Yeah, so. it's my third time vending at this event, so it's been pretty fun. A lot of people want like a business card, so there you go. Hopefully, Looking hopefully good. next time, yeah. <laughs> but uh, anyway, that's all for now, guys. Until the next video, thank you guys as always for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys for the next one.